In fact, they are predictions of the fall of Jerusalem. In Mark 13, for instance, in the parallel passages, it doesn't begin with the disciples saying, when are you coming back? It begins with Jesus saying, all this stuff's going to come crashing down, and the disciples saying, when will that be? The difficulty is, this is a real difficulty, especially at 8 o'clock at night when my body clock is telling me it's 1 o'clock in the morning, excuse me, um, that the language which they used to describe events like that was what some people have sometimes called apocalyptic language. That is to say, things like the sun will be turned into darkness and the moon will be turned into blood and the stars will be falling from heaven. Now, generations of Christians have thought that Jesus was predicting the end of the space-time universe. However, when you trace that language back into the Old Testament, and that bit about the sun and the moon and the stars comes from Isaiah 13. It isn't talking about the collapse of the space-time universe. 